there happening this weekend. City of Prattville getting ready to bring back the Wilson Pickett Music and Arts Festival. We're joined now by Minesia Steele and Martha Wilkinson. Ladies, thank you so much for joining us here on Alabama thank Live. You I yes, ask this you. every year, but okay. for people who don't know, who was Wilson Pickett? Well, I am going to uh, defer that to Minesia, mm -hmm. but Wilson Pickett is an R&B artist that is from Prattville, uh, and he uh, performed with a group called the Midnight Movers. Yeah, he did a, a lot for the community, and his family still does. They have the Wilson Pickett Legacy, and they're helping to fund this event. Uh, Wilson Pickett, like she said, soulful R&B, um, kind of that Motown sound. He, he, he was really... Um, a big influence on our community. So we're so happy to have the festival named after him. We named it after him in 2018. Previously, it was the Fountain City um, Music and Arts Festival. So people are probably familiar with that. Um, so yeah, come on yeah. out. This is music and arts. It is yeah. a true collaboration yeah. here in the city. What can people yeah. expect this year? Yeah. Oh. So oh. we are finding lots of ways to combine music and art. We have a lot of take and make projects. You can come and paint a record. We have free t-shirts for um, kids that they can take while supplies last, but we have free um, t-shirts. And we kept them pretty simple this year so they can paint and get real creative. We're gonna have um, fabric markers and all sorts of things for them to just go crazy on these t-shirts. Um, we'll have bouncy houses, we'll have performances as well. Yes. Um, we're starting the day off with line dancing. Oh, that's fun. So that's fun. gonna be fun. And then we're gonna move into some solo artists. We have a duet and we have um, two bands that are performing. So we're we're really excited about and that. And there's a kids zone uh, that will have inflatables and the kids, is, as she said, will get to paint these t-shirts. There's a, These are uh, record albums because it's a music fest mm -hmm. that uh, people Gotta can. Gotta stick with the theme. That's Absolutely. right, girl. And so they'll paint these and they can take it with them. And, uh, and there's a balloon artist balloon artists, making balloons. All mm -hmm. sorts of things. And then each of our community organizations, art groups, are going to have a table set up to promote um, our band and chorus. We'll have little blow up guitars and microphones Microphone. that they're passing out. Mm -hmm. And then <laughs> <laughs> also our theater, the Way Off Broadway Theater, will be out there with oh, costumes fun. and fun things. Yeah. And then our, um, our art guild will have their paint a truck activity. So Ooh. kids come in. Paint a pickup truck, which is I get to always paint it a good with time. Yeah, <laughs> temper paint. And How often do you get to do that? Yeah. yeah. For, so, for families who've never been out, why would you encourage them to come out this weekend? Yeah, it's why a great not? time. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's free. There's stuff to do for kids. There's stuff to do for adults. There's yeah, it's a full day. It's 10 to 5. You can stop by at any time. We'll have all these activities that we've talked about. We'll have the live music, the dancing in the morning. Food trucks is just there's beautiful so much location. To do. It's at Absolutely. Cooter's Pond Park, mm -hmm. and it's just beautiful right there on the Alabama River. And I just love it's got lots of trees and beautiful greenery and Spanish moss hanging from the trees. It's just a it's a really groovy vibe, and I think people would have a yeah, good day. Bring, bring your pets out too. There's a dog park not far from where we're setting everything up, so it's. Yeah, it'll be awesome. I think people forget too. There's a heavy art community. Yes, in, absolutely. In Prattville, absolutely. there's a lot of artists. There's a lot of art studios. Mm -hmm. So it's fun to be able to showcase that. Right, absolutely. and uh, uh, that she was mentioning way off Broadway theater. They're currently in rehearsal for their next production, which is a streetcar named Desire, mm -hmm. and that opens April 18th. So they can come and meet some of the actors and people that make all the magic happen. That's exciting to see all that stuff right here in our community. Remind people daytime location it is free to attend yes. you may want to bring some money for food and well, vendors yeah. and things like Absolutely. that but but free just to come out and have a good yeah, time free event, and that is this Saturday that is April 6 from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. it's at Coors Pond Park and then after that we're having a little after party with the Midnight Movers we mentioned that Wilson Pickett used to perform with over at the Doster Center at 6 o'clock so oh, y'all are going and all it, night long it's, and it's day. free as well, <laughs> it's free as well, as well. so yeah yeah, go have some fun at the festival and then go hear some great music. All right, my niece and Martha, thank you all so much for joining us here Absolutely. on Alabama Live. Thank you.